Hello and welcome to Golden Score, our third and final edition at this year's Paris Grand Slam. And what a day we've had. Thea Cowan, we're not going to hang around long here. Take it away. Well, we certainly <laughs> are. We're jam-packed this evening, actually. So first off, we will start with Anna Maria Wagner of Germany in the under 78 kilogram category. Let's welcome on the gold medalist. It, it, what's really nice is to get um, Anna Maria out here again because I know this is her favourite place. She likes to be out in the middle <laughs> with Hello the winners. Again. Congratulations. <laughs> welcome back. Thank you. Another great day. <laughs> How are you feeling about your Grand Slam win here in Paris? Amazing. It's my first ever medal and a gold medal. Uh, yeah. Now, I had a little look at the draw today and from a few draws previous, in Baku when you won the gold medal, you had the quarterfinal with Alina and then the final with Alice as well. Oh, really? Yeah. So <laughs> it was deja vu. Yeah, a bit of a deja vu yeah. moment. So let's talk first of all about your quarterfinal. Obviously, yeah. it's against your teammate and it's tight runnings yeah, at the moment. So we all know. Al it's always a hard fight and yeah, we know each other really well. We train together, we do run race together and Yes, I think today uh, my mindset was really, really good and mm -hmm. I think that was the decision why I stay so strong against her and I feel really, really good against her and yeah, all the time in my mind was, yes, you can do this and I, f I, f I felt it. Even in the warm-up, you were warming up with it and for a few people they were like, oh my God, they were even warming up together and I was like, well, yes, something maybe a bit special in judo, I suppose. So what... What is this like for you to have to know you warming up only to go out and fight? Um, yes, I think we we warm up every tournament. It's the mm -hmm. same, and we yes, I already told it. We know each other well, and I think this one more warm up it doesn't matter. So it sometimes it's good to warm up together because we have this little fight against mm -hmm. each other, and we both get really hot and on fire for the tournament and yeah it works and let's just go straight into the final shall we because it was a tough one of course against mm. Belandi it always is but this one particularly was quite an aggressive final for you both yeah it didn't start off that way it was it was reasonable <laughs> but something happened and then it got a bit punchy and yes. I it you, you got better when it got punchy yes <laughs> um yeah I, I felt good but yeah she's she's annoying with her judo and um, uh, I, I struggle a little bit, not with myself, but to come close to her and uh, she did it really, really good. Um, and all the time I say, I talk to myself, okay, breathe and one moment and you, you can do this. Let's so see if we can I'm look at some yeah. highlights, yeah. <laughs> make you, make you, you feel can tell better. us about these moments. <laughs> yeah. It's always tricky. What's it like coming out in such yeah, a big I'm, crowd? Yeah, I'm a little bit sad that <laughs> the decision or the I win with the third Shido uh, I prefer um, to throw her um, but yeah that's true though sometimes you win like this and not often they it have to be beautiful mm. <laughs> can I ask what you said to each other at the end because it looked like quite a nice exchange before you came I off. said I'm sorry about the decision because I want to win this game with the throw or we both want yeah. to win it and not like that and All right, well we, we like each times. other. Yeah. There'll be other times. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Big celebration tonight? Uh, I think a really, really good dinner tonight. And then I think I, I will sleep really good. Well, wait for me. I'll be, you know, an hour. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you can come with us. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank okay, you. Enjoy. Thank you very much. Thank so you. Much you. Yes. Yeah. Here I go. Anna Maria Wagner with a dinner invitation I shall take up. Right, who have we got coming <laughs> up next? <laughs> uh, next we have the bronze medalist at the under, under 100 kilogram category, Alexander Kokol of Serbia. He has had a rough day. Yeah, Not that indeed, anyone had yeah. an easy one, but this one particularly, I think. Welcome, congratulations. Congratulations. Hello, thank you very nice much. to see you. Thank really you glad much. to have you Welcome out Welcome back. <laughs> thank you. Settled in to 100 kilos now, yeah? But it I looks a lot better. That's a good word. I, th I feel like I settle in. I'm still not with a, like, I'm not over 100 even when I'm not close mm -hmm. to competition. Yeah. But I kind of feel even better when I, like, than, than when I was in 90. Like, I believe it's also the experience that, that piled up, so. And nicely placed in the ranking list as well. Comfortable yeah. looking at the top eight. I mean, yeah. is that in your mind for yeah, the Olympics? I, like, I'm not even sure. There is so many killers in the hundreds, so I, I'm not sure even that would be a like super 
great thing to be in the eight, and then you get. You just you just join the killers, by the way. Yeah, thank you. Uh, actually, I'm honored to be like in that conversation to to fight in during this era, like 100 kilo. I I don't remember. I I was following judo for 15 years. I I don't think there was a that many stars since I remember. So so actually, I don't know if in any category it means less than I <laughs> to be in the first eight. I yeah. think it's in it's in hundreds. So. We'll be we'll be delighted to see you in there. We're not going to keep you too long. We're glad that you can come out to join us. Just want to congratulate you again. Thank and you Neil and I said, you look the real deal in this weight category. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank it was my pleasure. Much. Always my pleasure. Thanks, Thanks Alexander. Okay. Thank Congratulations see you again. again. See you. Right. We're rushing people on uh, and good for a very for good it. reason because we're ready for the big man. He rushes out here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait. A big hug he, he needs a hug from Alexander, Alexander as well. As well. Uh, Teddy Rinner, congratulations again. Lovely to see you out Thank you. here. Great performance here in Paris. The last time we had your daughter running around. <laughs> Not here this time. but in uh, Doha. Yes. Yeah, right. Yeah, okay. yeah, I remember. Right, I think we're going to head straight in for the reaction here. Okay. How does it feel to the win again here in Paris? <laughs> really? The feeling is good, you know, uh, for the first competition for during this uh, special season mm -hmm. uh, for the Olympic game. It's a great tournament, great feeling. Uh, for the future, it's cool, it's cool. I take a lot of opponent uh, with a lot beautiful judo, very uh, strong, very top of the top. The Korean mm -hmm. is a great uh, opponent. And during the day, I have a, a lot of beautiful fighter. Yeah. And uh, it's uh, great for me, for my preparation. And I know uh, the base point for this uh, season is the Olympic game. So this tournament is very, it's great for my team, for me, for the future of my preparation. Yeah. Good opponent for you, Kim. First time you've been on. Yeah, I fight yeah? with him. Uh, the last time I fight with him is oh. uh, during a uh, 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 training camp. Yeah, yeah. And uh, he's not the same guy. No, he had a really <laughs> good spirit different. out here. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I'm, I'm going to give this a good go. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe you've done a bit of homework since. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But the, I know this Cor Korean is the good in uh, in the top. L Ten level, uh, top top ten of uh, this category. Yeah, I know. good one. Yeah, yeah. Now the arena was obviously jam packed, full of fans. But what was it like having your family here as well to watch? Ah, <laughs> ah. <laughs> it's cool because the. <laughs> oh look, we've even got them here. <laughs> this is an habitude, because <laughs> since my first tournament in cadet, uh -huh. my family is here. All the time, my family is my is in my luggage. <laughs> is my power is my oxygen Teddy, the the story the, the the fairy tale will continue right up until paris 2024 the olympic games you're this this close you you you're feeling that yeah <laughs> the feeling is hard because press family friend a lot you, of pressure. Are, your feeling is good everything's okay oh paris <laughs> olympic game ha huh? so step by step i have six months for prepare this mm -hmm. olympic game and I know it's nice. a, for an athlete like like me, it's a big, big story, big event. Because uh, after all these medals, mm -hmm. is a big target. At home, it's very hard. But it's an honor. It's a big target for my, for me, for for me. Yeah. And what about in comparison to your preparation for Tokyo? Because that was very difficult. Ah, very different, very difficult, very tough. Because during the COVID, very this is a special moment for an athlete. Mm -hmm. No family, nothing. Complicated. There, are, there are plenty of surprises along the way, including <laughs> this one. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm... <laughs> <laughs> We couldn't have one gold medalist and not the other, I suppose. <laughs> no, 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 no. Welcome, Roman. Okay, we, we can forgive her. She also took the gold medal. Have, you have to I, I let, I'll, I'll let you the oh, bench. Oh, wait, hold on. Maybe no, you, we can lead. You, maybe you can talk us. us through this action yeah. that we saw. Oh, no. Which one? Yes, this one. Oh. <laughs> 
If I know was Harry. I was getting out of the way of this. Dupont. Dupont for sure. No, no, no. Score for no, you. Dupont no, no, for sure. Tripont. Tripont. One, two, three. I thought it was. I, I thought it was on the skirt. Yeah, but below the belt. Ah, yeah. Chido. Chido but Dupont. We'll take it. We'll take it. The, the twelve and a half thousand people that came here paid their money, came to see a big finish. You came, you finished. Yeah. <laughs> for you it did the job. Uh, yeah. Thank you so well much. done. Well done, team. Yeah. And how is it for you to take the gold medal here today? It was amazing. You know, you won seven times. But Teddy's going to go. Right? Uh, <laughs> it's it's only exit, my, exit. my second time, you know, so <laughs> that was amazing. Um, yeah, before the Olympics, I really wanted to do something big here in my mm -hmm. city. And I think I did great. So, yeah, that was cool. I mean, that final was quite calm for you. Or it seemed it anyways. Let's only sims, yeah, yeah, but you know, I, I was really into my kimikata, my my cycle, um, and yeah, I, I was really concentrated, and I wanted to go, to do something great. Mm -hmm. I wanted to 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 show pe to people like uh, that I'm, you know, I'm I'm the the girl of the category, and I I'm <laughs> I'm here to, <laughs> to win the Olympics. So yeah, I think that was a good final. Yeah. Neil said that you could you could tell the focus on your face when you're coming out. We we felt that as well. It was really terrific. Yeah. Yeah. I think we might be I was in my match. <laughs> I think we might be able to see you see the and you're focused. Anyway. Yeah. Okay. The chair uh, when you came out was terrific. Too, too good for words, that one. <laughs> you know, I, I, that was a good match. Yeah, I, I, I think that was a good throw. Mm -hmm. Yes. And I did my, my best with the sleeve. And m m the tactic was, uh, tactical was be strong with your kimikata be strong with your with your the sleeve and yeah i was really okay. solid exactly Osa exactly the, Osa, Osa once you got down there you were, i am moved. not moving exactly exactly i i think i did a good job i did, think did i did you great. say anything to teddy when you were down there sorry <laughs> 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 it was a heavy landing it was terrific exactly. and quick it was a swift one yeah, yeah. it was it was what, what's no what's uh, sorry, excuse did you say? Oh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> right, okay, we're going to let you go off and celebrate. We like okay. to keep you, but we know you've got a lot of My other family things is to do. Yeah, for yeah. Me. Okay. Yeah. Go for it. Thank congratulations so again. Thank you so much. Thank you. Right. Thank Take you. Care. Congratulations. Roman Deco, gold medal winner in the plus 78 kilo category. We've got a wrap up of other things in our technical analysis, and we're going to invite Neil Adams out just to do that. There he comes. I wonder what he's got for us because today well, I don't know I don't know time. I have no idea this no. time I have no idea we are Neil, totally out of the loop surprise us uh -huh. surprise with the technical we analysis saw, let's have saw play oh, the technical we analysis Look at that. okay in we, we go we saw some <laughs> great stuff today didn't we I, I mean what can I say what really um, appealed to me was uh, so many contests won on changes of direction Mm -hmm. So many uh, so uh, counter techniques, you know, so people would attack and, you know, and, and of course, uh, the great Teddy Renaire there in his final match there just uh, picks the right moment and he gets the, uh, you know, he, he manages to turn it and, 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 and counter and, and, and win yet again, you know. But uh, Wolf Aaron uh, uh, particularly interested me because he, he looked like somebody on a mission. So we're going to have a look at uh, just a couple of his contests here. Uh, just have a look. When he's attacked and how he just changes direction here. And, uh, you know, he, well, that was a, a Kosoto. Uh, but, I mean, his uh, varied techniques, he's got the Uchi Mata, but he's got unusual grips as well. Uh, there's first one uh, with uh, an Ashi was uh, taking uh, his opponent over and control on the outside, all right? But uh, sometimes he has to uh, really change direction when he's attacked as well. Uh, I'm hoping that we're going to see that with this next one. It's the Ochi Gary that uh, I, I just love. I mean, he just drives off that bat leg there, as you saw there. I mean, he was uh, he just waited the right moment. He was attacked, and then he absolutely pushes off uh, the outside leg or the bat leg, and um, but uh, he controls it as well onto the shoulder, and he just has a knack of turning something to his advantage, you know. And uh, for me, uh, it made him very, very special. And then, of course, he goes into the final and he does exactly the same uh, in, in the final, you know, but I thought it was great. And you've already spoken about the great champion that is Teddy Rinish, so do you have some ideas? Well, I, I mean, you know, the thing is, uh, he had to come from behind 
didn't he? Uh, we saw him come from behind, uh, and he, you know he was thrown. Uh, but with mm -hmm. the Yoko Garuma that uh, he was thrown with there was fantastic. But it had two above, points yeah. of landing, so it wasn't yeah. a nip on, right? It was. It, it was. It looked very close at one point from yeah, this side. I have it, to say, it did do, <laughs> didn't it? You know, and it was massive yeah. uh, from uh, Yusupov. He, he just absolutely went for it. But Teddy Renner, being the great champion that he is, he absolutely digs in, all right? But not only does he dig in, so he comes back with a Wazari, mm -hmm. all right? And then he comes back uh, with a second one in order to, to, to gain a nip on and, to, and to, to win and to go through. Yusupov, I yeah, kind of half thought it was his, but it wasn't his. It was definitely Teddy Renner. He, he did come up with the nip on, and Neil would talk you through it, but unfortunately, we've lost the feed from here. Yeah. So, um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, but I mean, it's uh, just it's one of those, screen. isn't it? You know, <laughs> uh, but I mean, just to finish on and uh, to finish on a great event, you know, the great Teddy Renner, we keep seeing him coming out and he was in front of his home crowd, right? So that was fantastic. But, you know, he showed what a great champion he is mm -hmm. because uh, sometimes when you have to come from behind and he wasn't scared of going into extra time either. And uh, he just showed uh, yet again that he's a winner. Did you have one more for us? Um, I haven't because okay. we, we've, right. we've got right. nothing <laughs> there. You know, no, I haven't. Um, because we were going to do several on uh, Wolf Aaron and then changes of direction. And then I wanted to see the change of direction there. I mean, in the final match there with uh, Teddy Renner, where, you know, he just right. uh, changed his direction. But anyway, uh, brilliant stuff from uh, Teddy Renner. And yet again, he's on top of the rostrum. Great. That brings us to a close here in Paris. We'll be back in two weeks' time at the Grand Slam in Baku. We look forward to your company then. But from Neil, Thea, and all the broadcast team here in Paris, it's bye-bye for now. Bye for now. Bye-bye.